Hi guys, so as I mentioned in one of my previous videos, one of my wonderful subscribers got me a whole bunch of NYX lip glosses and I said I was going to come back and do a video where I was swatching the colors and you know also applying it so you could see what it looks like. So this video is just going to show you, you know, what colors I got and how it looks, you know, on brown skin complexion. Okay, so the first one is Miami Babe and it looks like this and this is the color that I have been wearing the most of because for me I think it's the perfect nude color for my complexion and this is what it looks like when you put it on so as you can see um, it's a beautiful nude color you know on my skin and um, yeah like I said I absolutely love this color I love this lip gloss Okay, so the next one I'm going to try is called Natural. Okay, so this is what this one looks like on. And it is very similar to the Miami Babe, but for me, this one comes out a little bit too strong. I prefer the pink undertone that the Miami Babe has. But yeah, it definitely still works as a nude color. Okay, so this one is called Tea Rose and it's a pink color. Um, this is one I actually purchased on eBay. Okay, so this is what this one looks like and it's got a very subtle hint of pink as you can see But it doesn't really come up that strong on my lips So this is one that I'd probably wear more as a clear gloss as opposed to you know something if I wanted color So that's what the tea rose looks like Okay, so the next one is juicy pink and once again, it's a pink color Okay, so on my lips, this one is pretty much a clear gloss. Um, absolutely no color whatsoever. Um, so yeah, that's juicy pink. It's very, very transparent. Okay, so the rest of the glosses have shimmer in it. This one is called Sponge Cake. Okay, so this is Sponge Cake. And um, yeah, it's along the lines of the neutral. But as you can see, it does have the shimmer in it. Okay, so the next one is called Salsa and it's a pale pink type of pastel -y color. And this is what this one looks like on. Um, it's definitely a stronger color against my complexion. I probably wouldn't wear this on its own. Maybe I would add it to a lipstick um, or something like that because I think you know against my brown skin it's a little bit too much for me but yeah this one is salsa okay so the next one is called taupe and that's what it looks like it's also a kind of pink color again and that's what taupe looks like on next I've got golden pink and that's what it looks like there and this is what this one looks like on. Um, it's a nice, natural, you know, um, gloss. So I could definitely, you know, wear this as an everyday type gloss. And the last one is called Lala, and that's what this one looks like. Okay, so this is what Lala looks like. It's a very pretty pink. I could definitely wear this on its own in replacement of a lipstick if I was, you know, completing a look. So yeah, this is really pretty. I like this one a lot and I may have to incorporate it a little bit more into my everyday um, lip glosses. So this is Lala. Okay, so looking at the swatches again, you've got the matte ones on this side and the shimmery ones on this side anyway guys i hope this video was helpful um i know when i was looking to buy some of these glosses i was looking for videos where people were swatching it because you know like i said previously they're not available here so it's hard to just look at the picture of the lip gloss from wherever you're purchasing and just you know know whether it's going to work for you or not so i hope this video was helpful to somebody out there um, i hope you enjoyed it as well and i will see you in my next video bye
Superstar. 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 Superstar.